guys and welcome back to a brand new episode of Zoys F2. But not only Zoys F2, oh no 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 no! We going back to Zoys F3 today. So guys, today it is Thursday, January 23rd, 2020. And today guys, you might see a few differences with the lab. First things first, you probably could notice the time machine is over there. Also, you might notice some digging spots over there too. And a few other things. So, yeah. <laughs> also, if you can also see over there, a lot more of the anniversary cake has been um, eaten up because um, we're in the last week of the <sighs> fifth anniversary party, you guys. Yeah, we are in the last week of the anniversary party. Literally next Thursday. Hold on, let me show you. Yeah, next Thursday, exactly a week from today, the entire anniversary party will be gone. And we won't see another one again until September. Yet we will not see another anniversary party regarding the lab until September because of Zoe's Ah! Wait! I'm wrong! Make that February 6th the next time we will see an anniversary party regarding the lab. Because two weeks from today is the three year anniversary of Zoys Lab 3. And I'm meeting the original Zoys Lab 3. That's right, you guys. Three, uh, two weeks from today is the third anniversary of Zoys Lab 3. So I'll probably have a mini event just for that on that day, and it'll probably last the whole week until the 13th. I don't know where things will go with that. But anyway, today in Zoys Lab 2, and yes, again, we will get to Zoys Lab 3 later. Uh, before we get into Zoys Lab 3, let's just show off what we have here in ZL2. Again, it is the last week of the anniversary party, and guys, we are only four days away until the Big Brother Season 7 finale video. Well, mainly just the finale itself. And yes, we are also exactly three weeks away from this, so that's cool. Alright, so yes, again, you can see the time machine over there. So, yes, and again, as you can see, a lot more of the cake has been uh, pretty much destroyed because it is the last week. There is only one slice left of every single one here. So as you can see, it is all destroyed now because the anniversary party is about to end in a week. Exactly a week from today, it'll be gone. So, yep, this is our last week of it. And yeah, I had a lot of fun with the anniversary party, even though I've not even gone on to the lab much. And also, exception for the fact that I didn't even go on, on the anniversary day, which sucked! But, that's okay. Anyway. Oh, yes! You can see, you did not see this sign last week. Nope, that was just added literally just today. In fact, only at least a few minutes ago, because I only just put in the update like a few minutes ago, actually. It did take, like, maybe 30 minutes to do all this. So it says, go back in time, and that's obviously why the time machine is there. Because obviously, we'd be going back in time today, you guys. But where? How far back in time? Well, you'll see in a minute. So it says, time travel party. January 23rd through the 30th. So there is a time travel party here in Zoazak 2. And... That is because, first off, well actually, the time machine, there is a message in the time machine that will actually explain why this is happening. Oh, and yes, I will read these in just a minute. Let's go inside the time machine. Now, I do have to go into survival. So, yeah, that's going to have to take the time off. And actually, I will stay in survival the whole time. So, let's read what this says. So, it says, Greetings, time travel. In celebration of four years since the time machine was created, and the final week of the fifth anniversary party, we're going back in time to older Zoids Lab events and even the prehistoric and future worlds. Day one, unreleased Zoids Lab 3 Halloween 2019. So that right there explains why we're going to Zoids Lab 3, and that also explains why this is here because. Well, yeah, so every day we're going to go back in time to an older event in Zoya's Lab history because since we've already hit over half a decade as of last Wednesday, 
I honestly thought it would be the perfect timing, and also since, as of two days ago, it has been four years since we created this very time machine, we also did that too. We will go to the prehistoric and future worlds probably sometime later this week. Oh, and uh, keep in mind, they are both still not transferred to Rose Crystal's new computer yet. We will probably do that probably sometime this week, or maybe even next week. I don't know when it'll happen. But it will happen eventually. Anyway, uh, we can just go out this side, technically, even though that's the way you're supposed to go out when you go to the press, or, well, uh, to the past. Alright, so you might notice, what the heck are these digging spots here for? Well, uh, take a look. Since the prehistoric and future worlds still aren't transferred over to Roscoe's new laptop yet, enjoy these two digging spots in the present will be removed once on new PC. So, as you can see, we got the permission here to dig. So, yep, we can just pick up the shovel. Oh, actually, we can go back into creative. Oh, there we go. And go back here. So, as you can see, we got a shovel. Now, there are actually, let me read this to you, dig for rare items from 2015. And that sign is actually not joking around. That sign is not a joke. It actually is. Rare items from 2015 that I'm pretty sure probably none of you remember unless you're way too smart enough to know this. But I did not have this channel in 2015, so <laughs> none of you remember what it is about to be in these holes. Although I'm pretty sure Rose Crystal will remember this. What the? Oh! Oh, right, because dirt is so easy to get rid of here. Because it's a shovel. That's right. First things first, we have the memorial sheep spawning. So let's pick that up. And yes, I do already have the spawning there. And the second one, yes, you might actually recognize it. Lapis. And I'm talking about the one from Legos Island. Why is he here, though? Well, I'll give you a hint, you guys, in just a minute. First things first, let's get uh, out of this hole. So, yeah, let's get out of here. Since we already dug through that hole, we're going to go to this other one. And, uh, well, actually, we should probably spawn Memorial Sheep in here. Yeah, let's yeah, let's spot memorial sheep in here. There we go. So yeah. All right. So now that we gotten that over with, what we're also going to do is we are also going to well. I know you guys probably did not think this was actually a true thing, but I'm going to do it anyway. Because, why not at this point? Say hello to... Lapis! Oh! Oh! Huh. Oh, wait! I think it's because my name is highlighted. Look. Look in the chat right there. My name is highlighted. So, as you can see, because I tamed this one... Uh, dog here, it now highlights with my name color. So yeah, that's a little cool special thing that's there. And yes, as you can clearly see, right here, we have Lapis. From Legos Island. You're probably wondering, why is Lapis here? Well, guys, proud to announce a little fun fact about this. Did you know that Lapis here originated from Zoe's lap! That's right! Before he came to me years ago, he used to only be a part of Zoe's lap, and that's actually where he was introduced sometime, I believe, in 2015. Probably still during the first Zola Lab, I think is when he was, like, introduced and stuff. So, to have him here again over five years later is pretty nuts. The last time we saw him here at Zola Lab was the first anniversary party four years ago in 2016, which is pretty nuts to believe. 
Now, unfortunately, when we do go to Zoys.free, his name will not be highlighted the way you see it. It will only go back to the original white text that you guys are used to. But it is cool just to see him there. So yeah, Lapis actually did originate from Zoys Lab before joining forces with me. So yeah, that's a little fun fact. But technically, I did kind of bring him over from Legos Island just to put him here. Now you're probably wondering, what is the other one? Well, we're going to go back in survival mode, and we're going to dig out the last two. Huh, looks like there's a hole there. Ah, there we go. Alright everyone, we got this. First off, we got a horse spawning that says, Midnight. I told you these items were rare! Oh, and of course, uh, let's grab the horse armor too. Alright, uh, let's uh, get out of here. So, uh, I don't think that's the right one. We actually have to get the right one. Like, we actually have- I think the original one- YEAH! IT WAS WHITE! Yeah, it was white. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! We need a saddle on this guy first! Eh, <laughs> Forgot. We need a saddle on this guy. Okay, we got 18 pieces of dirt, but we need to get on this guy. Uh, come on! Oh, oh, got him! Got him! And... Wow! I think this actually used to be Rose Crystal's original horse. Wait, hold on a second. I gotta get her over here to see if she actually remembers this masterpiece. Never mind. There's no need for it now. I can't find her. So, honestly, I'm pretty sure she'll probably remember her original horse that was called Midnight. I think she has an entire world based off of this. But that's back on our old computer. Anyway, what we're going to do now is send a... Uh, whoa! <laughs> uh, yeah, I did not mean to do that. We are literally going to try and get back up now. Uh, yeah, we do actually have to get back up. We have to get back up now. Uh, are you going to get back up? Ah, uh, there we go, I got it, I got it, I got it. Yep, we got backed up now. Uh... There we go! We're back now, just gotta go all the way over to the other side. There we go, now we're back. Anyway, now that I got this madness out of the way, what we're gonna do now is go back in time. To the famous ZL3, which I know you've not seen since like October. I think since even before the Halloween party. Holy frick. Has it really been that long? I'm pretty sure it's been that long. And let me tell you how long we've not been to Zola's that free for. I will literally prove to you. Here's my calendar. We're gonna go all the way back to October of 2019. And this right here, that was the last time we ever accessed Zola's App 3. Before today. Well, as of literally for telling you this, I have still not gone in there yet. And also, it is not updated to the latest version of Minecraft yet, so... Yeah, and also, I'm not going to change anything when I go in there. I'm literally just going to keep it all the same. Because I actually want to show you the unreleased... Halloween stuff that I wanted to show you, like, three months ago. And you're probably wondering, like, why am I doing this now, when I could have just done it three months ago? Just pretty much forgot at this point. But, uh, yeah, no joke, if you're wondering, Zona's have free still has Halloween decorations, which I never showed you. Which is pretty nuts to actually believe. So... Yeah, I am literally going to, uh, go there right now just so I can show you that really quick, and then that's actually going to be it for this whole episode. 
Literally, so let's go into survival. And here we go. All we have to do now is go into creative. And like so. Whoa! It immediately just teleported me to the nether. That was unexpected, even though that's technically what a nether portal means. Whoa! Okay, now we're actually going crazy with nether portals now. Okay, looks like it decides to load even quicker now than it did previously. So, we are going to head to Zoe's at 3 right now for a few minutes. Since I don't think there's actually much I even put there back in that. So, I don't think it'll be long of a tour. Because I don't really think I put as much there back then. In fact, because it's unreleased... I don't think I even ever finished it, so that's another reason why it do won't take long. Alright, for real though, let's go in. Trust me guys, what you're about to see will blow your mind. Let's go! Alright everyone, we're coming back. Oh my god! Oh my god! We're back! We're back! We're back! We are actually back in Soul's Lab 3 after, give or take, over three months! Oh my god, I forgot about all the cobwebs. We're stuck! <laughs> We're stuck! <laughs> okay, in actual seriousness, yes, we are back in Zoe's Lab 3 after clearly over three and a half months. Well, at least just three months in general. As you can obviously see, it is still. Still decorated for Halloween. That's because October 29, 2019 was the last time this world was ever freaking accessed. And yes, it's not even a joke anymore when I say that. Alright, everyone, guys, oh my god, it feels so weird just to be back here again after like three months. I'm literally going to show you everything that is completely unreleased about the 2019 Halloween event here at Zoe's Lab 3, which is so overdue. That means that this world was not decorated for Christmas. <gasps> no! <laughs> it was not even decorated for Christmas. That was honestly so sad. And look, see? Still outdated. It is so outdated. <laughs> still outdated. <laughs> but no, seriously, no, yes, it is still outdated. From literally like three months ago. Which is the most annoying part about it. It's just, it's still outdated from three months ago, and it's actually still pretty sad. When you think about it, and I don't really think there were any decorations in the um, other room, so that's why I'm not going to go there. Anyway, guys, we about to, uh, we about to have a mega adventure here. We're about to have an epic adventure. We are about to have probably the most epic adventure exploring through this unreleased version of the Halloween event of 2019 here on Zoe's F3, which is the most overdue event that we have ever done. And as you can clearly see down there, I already told you, the whole thing was not even complete. So, only half of the lab was decorated. Because it was never finished. <gasps> oh, I freaking hate myself now for not finishing it. But who cares, it is so overdue. I am literally going to change all of this back probably tomorrow or even next Thursday. It's definitely going to be done by next Thursday because, yeah, we got to change everything back. But, until then, we are going to go explore this. So, without further ado, everyone, let's go around and explore 
unreleased. So is that free Halloween event? From three months ago. <laughs> no, 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 I won't keep this on the whole time. I'll turn this off after tour, which shouldn't take long since I didn't do all the room. So, everyone, we are back in the, uh, Zoya's F3, which, as you can see, this is clearly outdated from, well, months ago. And, well, that never got updated as well. None of it, the whole event never even got fully released. Yeah, but as you can see, everything didn't fully get released around here. So as you can see, that's kind of what it was supposed to look like for Halloween, and that's also what the beacons were also supposed to look like for Halloween. And all this other stuff too, which is pretty crazy. So, well... Let's uh, go inside and see what else I did before it was unreleased. Yeah, here's what I did too. Even though this was never a full-on thing. And yes, yeah, he is still looking like that. Yep. Man, I cannot, I cannot believe this was fully an un unreleased event. Hey! This actually marks as us going back in time, because technically this is back in time. Because this is all unreleased. And yeah, here's what the flower shop was supposed to look like. <laughs> flower sheet. Since this is back in time, of course they look different. So yeah. Um, the road closers are nothing different, as you can probably clearly see. Man, I know. I know, guys. I know it's been so long since you've seen this place. And don't worry. Starting in this episode, we will be back to Zoya's F3. Well, not in every episode, of course. There will be every once in a while where you will see this. I mean, I'm going to get back to it um, pretty much from now on, of course. I will get back to Zoya's F3 as of today, pretty much from now on, of course. It's just, look at all this stuff that you got that it was never fully released. I know, doesn't it look so cool? Let's go down here. Whoa, 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 I think I forgot something. Out here, too. Wow, actually, I was wrong. There is nothing out here. Alright, here's more unreleased content from ZL3. Yep, that's kind of how this was all supposed to look for Halloween back in the day. Until it never got fully released. Ah, oh, so sad. Here's what this also looks like. And I don't think I actually ever completed the rest after that. At least for this room. Did I complete in here? Yup, I did! Yeah, there's not too many rooms that I did, so yeah. Don't expect this to be really big. And I'll even prove to you how this is not super big. Because look! No difference with the HQ, it is still the same. And look, I don't think I've even highlighted any of this yet. 
I'll give you more proof. Yeah, as you can probably notice, a lot of these signs aren't even highlighted with colored text. As you can see, no updates. Yes, there's HQ Secretary. Alright, what's the next piece of unreleased rooms? Whoa! Okay, that might be a little lag. Okay. Looks like uh, this forgot to be unreleased. Actually, I should never even have broken that because, well, I'll be fixing it. Oh, and you want even more proof that this is still unreleased? Look what's still here! The March 2019 catalog! Oh, and yes, that sign is also still here! Oh, and even more proof? Yep, still only two of them! We will get back on track with that in February. Or maybe even in March, exactly a year after we last released one. And I think this was actually the last room I got to before I actually stopped. Well, you could have already tell that I decorated this room because of the beacons. And that was actually kind of it. Yep. And I'll literally give you proof. Watch this! Nothing else! It's all still the same! Look! It is all still the same! Yep, nothing else changed! Yep, it is still the same! Look, I did not do anything else after the underground party room. And another piece of proof? Yep. Look, nothing else. And even more proof that I've still never updated anything? Yeah. Look how outdated all of this is. Ah. Oh. So much stuff that's been outdated. Yeah, we need to get back on track with this lab ASAP. And I definitely gotta clean everything up. Because it is way overdue for Halloween. And that's three months ago. And yes, DJ Sheep still looks the same. Everything's outdated! Well, everyone, that's it. That's literally it for our entire tour. And you know what? Just for fun, I am going to explore the, uh... Well, I'm gonna go on all the roller coasters again, just because, well, you have not seen me ride them for probably like three or four months. Here we go. The minecart still move? Please tell me. Does it still go? Is the minecart even there anymore? I don't think it's there anymore. Wow, I think we got rid of it. Okay, it looks like we forgot to place that.
Alright, so, well, we're actually done. Well, looks like we can go back to the present. Because, well, <laughs> yep, we've been in the past all this time. So, yep, we technically went all the way back in time. Because, as you can see, my inventory is outdated. Yep, we literally went back in time. Even though this is still technically how Zoya's Lab 3 actually does look in real time. Technically, it feels like we were actually going back in time anyway, because uh, it's still outdated. So, yep, that's it. So, we can go back to the present, and I'm going to end the video right now. In fact, I'm going to go record something on CBPS, and if that video happens to go up before this video, then you can ex then that'll explain why, because this video will probably take an hour to upload like usual. And yeah, so yeah, if you do see today's Chili Gun Sleepy PS episode, which I'm going to go film right now, if you see that before this video, just know that I uploaded that first because this video would probably take a really, really, really long time to upload just because of how long I made it. And anyway, guys, now let's go back to the present. For real this time. It's really funny because there's actually two lands. No, we're going back to Solo Lab 2. And that's also the only one that's open because you can only have one at open at once. It still has two lands there, just because, um, I just forgot to close the tab. Anyway. We are going to, uh, end the video. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I'm already in it, creative! I meant to go on survival map. Whoa, whoa! Uh... Well, guess we could've just came out of this one, but... Yep. Anyway, what do you all think of that little update I added? This is for the last week of the uh, anniversary party, as it does again end next Thursday, January 30th. And guys, with that being said, thank you all so much for watching today's episode of Zoa's Lab 2 and 3 Update. <laughs> This was honestly a really fun episode to do today. I'm honestly glad I was able to make it because it was honestly finally about time we went back to Solar's Lab 3 and today was honestly the perfect timing to do so. And let's see if I can try and get Midnight back up here. Okay, we did. <laughs> Yay! Anyway, again, thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe. I'll see all of you for turning on Sleepy Fest. Now, if that, again, if that video goes up before this video... Um, just letting you know, I am on Club Penguin Rain right now, and as you can clearly see, the Festival of Lights party is still not here, and it actually is true. I only just got idle now, so yeah. And you can't even see me, because I'm literally right here somewhere in the middle. So yeah. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go make chilling on Civic PS, and this video is probably gonna go up after that. Oh, come on, I got myself stuck again. Anyway. Um. With that being said, thank you all so much again for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later for that. Um, and again, this might be my last upload of the day, because even though this would be my first video being filmed today, if, again, Julian with CVPS does go up before this video, which, again, I'm pretty sure guaranteeing it will, then, um, yeah. Uh, yes, I will see you, um, I guess all tomorrow for another video, if Julian with CVPS does go up first. Which, again, I'm pretty sure it will. And by the next episode, guys, I'm pretty sure that this party will be gone. Although, I could film some stuff with the time travel party if you guys want. Just comment down below. Anyway, I'll see you guys probably tomorrow when this video does go up after Chilling on Super PS. Which I'm pretty sure, again, it will. So, if so, I'll see all of you tomorrow for more videos such as a video for Bubstoke. Because tomorrow is the 4 year anniversary of Vault Life series. I know. <laughs> oh, Rose Crystal, only a few more days until she can get her technology back. Oh, yay, only four days, only four days, you guys. Four days till she gets her technology privileges back. 
because it took two weeks off of technology and that was two weeks are almost up. Yay! Although it was a good thing that she did do that because, yeah, anyway. Yeah, thank you guys so much for again a video profile episode, backyard videos, Legos Island, and Club Angry Rain for the Festival of Lights because let's face it, it's probably not even going to come out today, mainly just because I've been waiting so long. And as you can see, even though you can't see it, loads of people have been waiting too, so... Yeah, and I'm also on Blizzard, even though you can't see it. Uh... Anyway... Yeah, see you later, guys! Hi! Bailey? See you tomorrow.